Hello, I'm Harold with WorldTVOnDemand.com. Today I'm going to show you how to hook up your devices through your power supply for your internet. So I'm going to go to the router first, show you how to hook that up, and then I'm going to show you on any device that you want to plug in for internet that you're not getting a good Wi-Fi signal. You can just plug it into your power outlet and you have your internet in any room in your house or on your property and it works great and I use it and I recommend to use it that way you're not having Wi-Fi in your house and uh, people can log on to your Wi-Fi and steal your Wi-Fi so let's go to the router first and see how that's set up and I'll be right back that's worldtvondemand.com you can also go to our website and you can click on any of these links to see videos on how to do different things. Uh, for example, the G-Box MX2, it'll show you how to connect to the internet, and the, the Q-Box, it'll show you how to hook up to the internet. And also, uh, the live news channels shows you how to get to those. Shows, tells you about Phoenix, you know, some updates that we have. And if you've lost your Sports Devil, I have a link here that you can go right in and you can get your Sports Devil back on your box. But right now we're going to check on the Ethernet and show you how to make your outlets in your house, uh, your Internet service that you can just plug in your Ethernet cord to to get Internet through your outlets. Now, don't pay any attention to everything else I got going on here because I've got a lot of things going on. But you can go to Tiger Direct or Best Buy or you can order them online, these uh, Ethernet extenders. And what you do is you plug it into the outlet and you take your Ethernet cord and you plug it in to the bottom of your router. So that sends the signal from your router to this device and now all your outlets in your house has internet via ethernet cord. And I'm going to show you how I do that with my uh, computers and when I'm programming boxes I'll show you that too. So just go to your store or go online and look for Ethernet extenders and this is the one that I use. It's the Ultra. Now I know my room here is a little messy. I've got my my computer, my second monitor, a uh, monitor for programming my boxes, two of them because I do usually do at least two boxes at a time when I'm programming them. And so what I did is I have an extension cord here you can use an extension cord, but you cannot use a power strip, but you can use an extension cord. And I've got it over here and I've got my power supplies plugged in. But as you can see right here, I have my Ultra Powerline Ethernet Bridge 500 Mbps. That's what I use. And it works fantastic. So but what I do, one step further, is I always have more than one thing I need to plug in. So what I did is I got a Netgear. It's a ProSafe 5 port gigabyte switch. And I can plug in four devices in this. So I come out of my, my power supply to my Ultra with my Ethernet cord plugging into my, my Netgear. And now it gives me one, two, three, four ports that I can plug four devices in and, and surf the internet or program boxes or whatever the case may be. So why, if your Wi-Fi is not working well or you're not happy with it and you're having buffering if issues, this will cure a lot of those problems. And... Uh, and you won't have that anymore. So here's one of our boxes and that's how you hook it up. That's the Ethernet I just plugged in. It does have Wi-Fi 
the Wi-Fi works very good on these boxes if you want to use the Wi-Fi but I prefer the hardware. So I'm Harold and I'm with WorldTVOnDemand.com and I hope that helps you if you're having trouble with Wi-Fi and you want a better signal to your devices whether it be your TV top box, your smart TV, your laptop, whatever it might be if you need a better signal because you're having buffering problems that's what I recommend to fix it. And if you have any other uh, questions you can go to WorldTVOnDemand.com and you can also uh, I've got a video there about antennas, what antenna to use so you can get local channels in HD and if you need to buy another box we have them on sale for $169.99 and you can just click on add to cart and I will send you one uh, if you need to call there's our number, our contact information and this is some of the things that you'll see on our website that you will get on the box. These are not clickable uh, or playable movies. It's just showing you what is available in the box if you buy one of the boxes. And you know all these movies are already out and on the box. And all the TV shows are on demand and it's all series, you know, all ever show that they've had. And uh, just wanted to share that with you. And if you're into watching TVs and movies on demand, this is the box that I use, and I would rec highly recommend it. And, and again, that's WorldTVOnDemand.com. And I look forward to your comments and questions, and I hope this video helps you out. Have a good day.